Do you know how common high blood pressure is and how it can impact your health? High blood pressure, also known as hypertension, is a condition that affects a staggering one in three adults in the United States. That's a third of the adult population living with a condition that can silently damage their health. Globally, the World Health Organization estimates that nearly 1 billion people are grappling with this health concern, making it a truly universal issue. High blood pressure is often dubbed the silent killer because it typically presents no symptoms until it's too late. It works quietly, straining your heart, hardening your arteries and setting the stage for serious health problems down the line. The health risks associated with high blood pressure are not to be taken lightly. It's a major risk factor for heart disease, the leading cause of death worldwide. When your heart is forced to work overtime to pump blood, it can lead to heart failure, heart attacks, and even sudden cardiac death. But the heart isn't the only organ at risk. High blood pressure can also lead to stroke, another top killer. When the pressure in your blood vessels is too high, it can cause a blood vessel in the brain to rupture or be blocked by a blood clot, leading to a stroke. And let's not forget kidney disease, which is often caused by high blood pressure damaging the blood vessels in the kidneys. The numbers are sobering, but it's not all doom and gloom. The good news is that high blood pressure can be managed and even prevented. It's within our power to make lifestyle changes that can significantly lower our blood pressure and keep it within a healthy range. Given these risks, it's important to understand how you can manage your blood pressure naturally. In the following scenes, we'll delve into natural ways to lower your blood pressure including diet, exercise, and stress management. Stay tuned to learn more about these effective strategies. First, let's understand what blood pressure is and why it matters. Blood pressure is the force exerted by your blood against the walls of your arteries. When your heart beats, it pumps blood into these arteries which is when your blood pressure is at its highest, known as systolic pressure. Between beats, when your heart rests, your blood pressure falls. This is diastolic pressure. A typical blood pressure reading might be 120 over 80. The first number represents the systolic pressure, the second, diastolic. High blood pressure, or hypertension, is a condition where this force is consistently too high, straining your heart and damaging your arteries. It's a silent killer, often showing no symptoms until it causes severe complications like heart attacks or strokes. Now that we understand the importance of maintaining a healthy blood pressure, let's explore some natural ways to achieve it. Our diet plays a crucial role in managing our blood pressure. One of the most effective strategies for controlling blood pressure is through our daily food choices. The dietary approaches to stop hypertension, better known as the DASH diet, has been scientifically proven to reduce blood pressure naturally. This eating plan encourages us to consume a variety of nutrient-rich foods and limit those with high sodium, saturated fats, and sugars. The DASH diet revolves around several key food groups. First, fruits and vegetables. These natural treasures are packed with essential nutrients like potassium and fiber, both of which are known to lower blood pressure. Potassium helps our bodies flush out excess sodium, balancing our blood pressure, while fiber aids in maintaining a healthy weight and reducing the risk of hypertension. Next, we have whole grains. Whole grains like brown rice, oatmeal, and whole grain bread are an excellent source of fiber and other nutrients that play a vital role in regulating blood pressure. Then, lean proteins, especially fish rich in omega-3 fatty acids like salmon and mackerel, can lower blood pressure and inflammation. Dairy is also part of the DASH diet but it's important to opt for low-fat or non-fat options to keep our hearts healthy and happy. And let's not forget about nuts, seeds, and legumes. These small but mighty foods are high in magnesium and fiber, which help keep blood pressure in check. But remember, it's not just about what we eat, but also how much we eat. Portion control is a significant part of the DASH diet and overall healthy eating. And of course, it's crucial to limit sodium intake. Too much sodium can lead to water retention, which can raise blood pressure. The DASH diet recommends keeping our sodium levels under 2,300 mg per day. But a healthy diet is just one part of the equation, let's see what else we can do. Physical activity is another key player in maintaining a healthy blood pressure. Just as a well-tuned engine runs smoothly, so does a body that experiences regular exercise. Exercise helps lower blood pressure by making your heart stronger. A strong heart pumps more blood with less effort. If your heart can work less to pump, the force on your arteries decreases, lowering your blood pressure. Now when we talk about exercise, it's not just about running a marathon or bench pressing 200 pounds. Regular, moderate physical activity can make a world of difference. Let's delve into some of them. 
First we have cardio or aerobic exercises. These are exercises that get your heart rate up and make you breathe harder. They include activities like walking, jogging, cycling, swimming, or even dancing. The key here is consistency. Aim for at least 30 minutes most days of the week and you'll be on your way to a healthier heart and lower blood pressure. Next, we have strength training. This might make you think of bodybuilders and gym rats, but strength training is beneficial for everyone. It involves activities that make your muscles work harder than usual, like lifting weights or doing push-ups. Engaging in strength training at least two days a week can complement your cardio workouts and contribute to lowering your blood pressure. There's also flexibility and balance exercises. These might not directly lower your blood pressure but they support overall physical fitness and help prevent injuries. Yoga and Tai Chi are two great examples. Remember, if you're new to exercise or have been inactive for a while, it's always wise to talk to your doctor or a fitness professional before starting a new exercise regime. They can help you find a routine that's safe and effective for you. In the grand scheme of things, it's important to remember that exercise is just one piece of the puzzle. It works best when it's part of an overall healthy lifestyle that includes a balanced diet, maintaining a healthy weight, and not smoking. In addition to diet and exercise, let's uncover another natural method to lower blood pressure. Managing stress is a powerful tool in controlling high blood pressure. When we're stressed, our bodies respond by releasing stress hormones, which speed up our heart rate and constrict our blood vessels. This is the body's way of preparing us to face a perceived threat, often referred to as the fight or flight response. However, if this state of high alert becomes the new normal, it can lead to high blood pressure, damaging your arteries, and increasing your risk of heart disease and stroke. But how exactly does one manage stress? There are several techniques, and it's all about finding what works best for you. One of the most common and effective methods is mindfulness. This involves focusing your mind on the present moment, without judgment. By tuning into your senses, you can help to quieten the chatter of the mind and reduce feelings of stress. Deep breathing exercises also play a crucial role in managing stress. The simple act of taking a few slow deep breaths can help to reduce your heart rate and blood pressure. There's a reason why we're often told to take a deep breath when we're feeling stressed or anxious. It really does help. Another helpful method is progressive muscle relaxation, where you tense and then release each muscle group in your body, starting from your toes and working your way up to your head. This can help to relieve physical tension and promote a sense of calm. Regular physical activity, a balanced diet and a good night's sleep are also key in managing stress. These not only help to reduce stress levels but also have a direct, positive impact on your blood pressure. Lastly, don't be afraid to seek help if you're struggling. Talking to someone about your feelings can be a huge relief and a big step towards managing your stress. With these strategies in mind, you're well equipped to naturally lower your blood pressure. Before we wrap up, let's quickly summarize the natural ways to lower blood pressure. It's quite simple really, it all begins with a healthy diet. Consuming a balanced mix of fruits, vegetables, lean proteins and whole grains can significantly decrease your blood pressure. Reducing your sodium intake is also key. Next, we have regular exercise. Engaging in physical activities, whether it's a brisk walk in the park or a high-intensity gym session, can greatly help in maintaining a healthy blood pressure. And last but certainly not least, stress management. In this fast-paced world, stress is unavoidable. However, how you manage it can make all the difference. Incorporating relaxation techniques like meditation, deep breathing, and yoga into your daily routine can help keep your blood pressure in check. Remember, maintaining a healthy blood pressure is a lifelong commitment, but with these natural methods, you're on the right path.